No need for cell towers. China has revolutionized smartphone. Modi government in India just lean read that in a landmark achievement for satellite communications, Chinese scientists have developed the world's first satellite capable of enabling smartphone calls directly without the need for ground-based infrastructure. Named Tiantong, which translates to connecting with heaven, the initiative draws inspiration from the biblical story of the Tower of Babel, aiming to bridge communication gaps rather than create them. Slumdog investigates. Slumdog goes deep throat to get the information. Slumdog gather the facts. Slumdog analyze information you can rely on. Slumdog lay low in the slums with common people, and Slumdog knows common people problems. Slumdog, please remember the name because this dog came from slums. This dog proves that how hungry you are for the truth. To get all the updates, please like, share, click on bell icon, comment on the video, and subscribe the video. The Tiantong-1 satellite series, which began with its first launch on August 6, 2016, now includes three satellites in a geosynchronous orbit at 36,000 km, covering the entire Asia-Pacific region. This breakthrough came to fruition when Huawei Technologies released the world's first smartphone supporting satellite calls in September of the previous year, leading the way for other manufacturers like Xiaomi, Honor, and Oppo to follow suit, a South China Morning Post report said. These technological advancements have proven invaluable, particularly in emergency situations where traditional communication networks are compromised. For instance, during the 6.2 magnitude earthquake in Gansu province on December 18th, affected individuals could maintain contact with the outside world thanks to the satellite call function available on their smartphones. Direct satellite connectivity for mobile phones has become a new development trend, and satellite communication will gradually become popular among the general public, noted a team led by Qi Wanzhou from the China Academy of Space Technology. Their work, detailed in the Aerospace Science and Technology Journal, highlights the overcoming of significant technical challenges related to passive intermodulation, PM, which can degrade the quality of satellite calls. By addressing the PIM issue, the team has enabled exceptionally sensitive reception capabilities in the Tiantong satellites, allowing them to pick up signals from standard smartphones without the need for external antennas. This capability is critical, especially given the satellite's exposure to extreme temperature variations and their operation across multiple frequency bands. The idea for such a satellite came about after 2008, when Sichuan, a province in southwestern China, was struck by a devastating magnitude 8 earthquake, resulting in the tragic loss of over 80,000 lives, what made the situation far worse back then was the communication breakdowns in affected areas, which in turn severely hindered rescue operations, thus compounding the crisis. In response to this disaster, the Chinese government started the Tiantong Project, a satellite communication system. The purpose of the satellite is to provide universal access to communication services, irrespective of socioeconomic status. China's advancements in this field are securing its position as a leader in satellite communication technology globally, heralding a new era where geographic isolation no longer equates to communication isolation.